Hey y'all, my name is Cass. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new, I post videos all about DIY, budget friendly content creation to enhance your brand, business, or just create better content in general, you guys. And today I'm super excited because I'm giving you guys a home studio transformation. As you guys may or may not know, I have been mainly shooting in a corner in my bedroom for the most part for all of my photo shoots. So I'm super excited that we are renovating this room in the house because I got special permission. I got the decree and um, I was allowed to temporarily while I'm staying here temporarily at home with my fam, turn this room into a studio. So I'm super excited to have more space to shoot. I really love the look of this room. It has a lot of like class and inspiration to me. Let's get into it. Good day. <laughs> so today we are doing a home studio makeover. Of course, if you guys have seen any of my plethora of bedroom studio videos, um, I have these all this equipment here. So I have like my lights, my tripods. Um, under my bed I have some like some duffel bags I have like my props kind of over here some of my backdrops so I kind of just have everything in this area so this is currently the space so this is kind of the area I already cleared out and I've been using so I have my green screen here I already have my black backdrop here one of my soft boxes fans I have some chairs this Miwa so I'm kind of need to clear out this area. I think I kind of want to keep the table here. Hey, Coco. She likes to be in my studio. All right, so in my studios, I like to keep my lighting and stands and everything propped up for the most part because it makes it just a lot easier when I go in and just start to shoot. I don't have to set all that up. Um, props, I do need a location, something to put props in or just storage in general. Um, and yeah, I think most of the stuff other than that is just going to be clearing out. Wait, do you little doggy? Come here, Coco. Can you move? <laughs> so another thing I do is a lot of wardrobe changes in my videos. You guys see I use my canopy bed a lot to have my wardrobes. So I think it'd be nice to also have a clothing rack. So we're gonna go to the store, get a clothing rack, something to store, um, some props in. All right, you guys, so back from shopping. I got this basket here for my stands, my backdrops, all that good stuff. We have this Jorothy from Tarjay for the props equipment. And then, ugh, don't die yet, camera. And then we have this beautiful garment rack for my clothes, outfit changes. Um, so yeah, we're just missing, I'm gonna order a desk off of Amazon, a standing desk so I can edit and do like, if I can do makeup and all that good stuff here. And we're gonna move all the equipment downstairs. moved all of my studio equipment everything downstairs so tomorrow we're gonna go ahead take care of setup clean up all that good stuff i'm gonna go ahead and order the desk off of amazon now it's going to be a standing desk place your order so this is definitely the more expensive thing that i'm buying but like i said i'm looking at this for my future house my future apartment i want a standing desk i like to stand and work i like to stand and do these videos for you guys it makes me a lot more Whoopity do. The desk has arrived. Father's building it because it wouldn't look like this if I built it. 
Looks good. I got it on Amazon. Linked below. Non-sponsored yet. It's a fuzzy bow. Fuzzy bow made in China. Added the wheels to the bottom. Christmas tree still up. Peace out. All right, you guys. The day has finally arrived. I'm gonna finish this home studio makeover, whether I like it or not. We're just gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We have a visitor. Hey, Cookie. Hey, girl, girl. Hey, little girl. She hangs out in my studio a lot. So you gotta help me, Coco. When you do a doggy photo shoot, a doggy photo shoot. Okay, hi. As you enter the studio, you are greeted by these three beautiful chairs. They're great for guests. I use these if my standing desk is a low desk, it'll be my desk chair. Or if I just have a shoot or I need some chairs, we have these three lovely, beautiful chairs here that are from the original dining room. So, you know, it just gives me a blast from the past to the next area. So right here is where most of the equipment is pretty much stored. So I have this um, set of drawers that I got from Target. Yes, they are missing the handles, all that good stuff. But you know, it's life, man. So on the top here, barely holding on, um, I have my Harman Kardon speaker. I'm definitely gonna invest in like a better bookshelf setup or something. But I have my Harman Kardon speaker for when I'm working out, doing a shoot. You know, I love music, so I like to have that. I have this little director's announcement thing that I got as a gift. Um, behind all this, I actually have my charging station kind of hidden. So it has my batteries charging for my cameras back there on a power strip um down here i have my this first drawer here holds all of my lighting so i have all my light bulbs my anything that has to do with lighting reflectors um fairy lights all that good stuff's here second drawer i just kind of have the rest of my camera equipment so i have like lenses batteries cords um other cameras my projector all that good stuff and at the very bottom here i just have some more props so i have like my sparkly stuff some tools some fake money um cards mirrors so any other additional props are just right there so happy to finally have a place for my props and then this basket over here i also got from target is just storing my backdrops i have my seamless paper backdrops my just rolls of paper um i have my white sheet in there and some extra stands so i have my phone tripod um and some other lighting stands and then kind of in between here i just have my larger reflector it couldn't fit in here and then i have my yoga mat because i do like to work out in here 
as well so i have my yoga mat my workout gloves right there this isn't really permanent i just kind of have this stuff here because this is what i shoot with most often so it's easy for me to just drag it over but i just have like a soft box my other camera um and my portable led light that's not really portable but this is the led light y'all pretty much always see me shoot with then we have our beautiful window it's currently raining so it's not as beautiful today but all good but over here in this corner you guys i have two more chairs again these chairs are just used for sitting sometimes i'll put my laptop on here um if i'm watching like a workout video i will use them for shoots just depends and then i have my fan right here for when i want to be beyonce jennifer lopez um, i just have my black duffel bag here which has some stands extra equipment that i don't really use as often i have this beautiful mirror you guys having a mirror in your studio full length is like life-changing so definitely when you can invest in a mirror because love it love it for working out love it for shooting love it for everything and then right here i just have my plant that you guys probably have seen in my room if you guys have watched my previous videos but i just moved it down here because i mainly just use it for shoots and then down here i have some additional um foliage props so i just have like some fake roses some fake flowers that i probably got from like michael's so let's go to the studio wardrobe area so if we shift over a little bit from there i actually got this um whatchamacallit i know what it's called but i'm blanking right now clothing rack yeah i got this clothing rack also from target you guys just because my shoots do have a lot of fashion pertaining to them or clothes or outfit changes um so i thought it'd be nice to actually have a clothing rack in here so i can just have my clothes my outfits for upcoming shoots anything that i need to shoot in or want to shoot in so this is from my new year's shoot um these were the two outfits i was kind of choosing between and i chose this one if you guys saw that video um that recently came out but i just have this rolling clothing rack i tried to get everything to be as mobile as possible in case i have to move or shift things um because it's also a great wall to hang backdrops on if need be and then i just had kind of have my other softbox chilling over here so let's go to the final area of the studio all right you guys so this is the actual studio setup i actually am using my backdrop stand in previous videos if you see my bedroom at home studio you guys know i usually pin up my backdrops but now i actually have space for my backdrop stand so i actually had my green screen on here from a previous shoot and i just laid my black um cloth backdrop on here to do a different shoot instead of having to switch them out but you can totally switch them out definitely an option there and then i just have my standing desk here um currently so i have my laptop on here because i was doing an editing tutorial recently um i just have my wacom tablet and then my book and my phone that i'm reading um, but this is a really nice desk you guys i got it off of amazon it can go down to a regular desk size it can come up i set different modes on here this is really great you guys i love this for videos i love this for a desk in general again this is also on wheels so i can easily slide it out the shot bring it in Put it over there to those seats if i just want to have it as a regular desk whatever you want to do so definitely guys make sure if you're doing a studio that it's as mobile as possible so that you can easily be flexible and do different shoot setups you guys but that is it for my home studio tour so i hope you guys enjoyed this tour if you do have a spare bedroom or a spare space or even if you only have a corner in your bedroom i have plenty of videos on creating your own at home studio you guys it's really really great if you're an artist photographer model whatever you're doing to have a space where you can just constantly shoot manipulate the lighting on your own um definitely something that i've adored having and that i pretty much have had since this quarantine and used um at home all this time for my shoots but thank you guys so much for watching have a wonderful wonderful 2021 you guys i am out see you in the next one